One of the things I enjoy about my blog is that it lets me see how life changes over time. In that respect, it's nice to have a constant. This week, Doc and my brother's backyard serve that role quite nicely. Because if you remember, not too long ago, but somehow a lifetime away, a little pup scampered under Doc's paws. We swung by this week to let Doc out, and I was reminded of how quickly a little pup can grow into a big lug. Those trees, which once hit zero like a forest, well, they can now barely cover that thick skull of his. It's not so easy these days for Penny to toss him around, or for Doc to ignore. Both then and now, Doc remains incredulous he's surrounded by such lunacy. But Zero's not the only fast-changing 10-week-old we've cared for. Lincoln hit that mark this weekend, and my little pup is doing his best to keep up with Zero's growth curve. I think it's just about dead even when it comes to whose claws grow faster, but Emily says I'm not allowed to grind Lincoln's nails yet. In the size department, Lincoln's working on doubling his weight, while Dad realized he may need to cut back on dessert. And Zero, our wrinkly little ball of cuteness, well, he's definitely more than doubled his weight. And while still as lean as can be, the not so little guy is already about 85 pounds. Change and growth is tiring work, but I'm lucky to be able to share and witness that work here. And Lincoln, well he's lucky to have a sister to lay his head on, and a brother who knows just how hard it is to be a big baby.